<sighs> Damn, Q. Maybe you did that. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. Everybody loves BBW. That's beards, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is back in the building, man. Got Angry Principal off camera. What's up? Got my man Bo holding it down. I say. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Uh, we back this week with another joint that I've actually never had, so I'm always excited to uh, find new stuff. And of course, uh, as the weeks progress, the proof has gotten higher, of course, right? Go. So this one's at 110, right? This is a uh, Clyde Mays. If you can see that, bam, bam, there it is right there, Clyde Mays. Now, Clyde Mays has got quite a few different expressions. Uh, so we got the uh, Special Reserve Straight Bourbon, 110, like I said before. Um, they said it is an Alabama whiskey, so it's uh, go taste apple I guess, right? So uh, anybody got some other things you want to say about it before we pop the court? I've had a, lo a different version of this, okay. the Clyde Mays, and the Alabama style was like, Alabama style. I didn't know what it was. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's definitely made with apples in the mash. Mm -hmm. so gotcha. okay. That's the one thing I know about it. All right, yeah, just a little side story, too, about it. Yeah. So, supposedly, um, Clyde Mays, you know, he was like a for real, like, kind of made it, made, made his own way. You know what I mean? Okay. Self made dude. Yeah. Because, uh, I guess his, his, he, he was a son to a single mother in Alabama during the Depression and all that good stuff. Word. Right. So, okay. he kind of had to hustle. Yeah. You know, to kind of get, get his, uh, he's also a white dude in Alabama in 1922, <laughs> so you know how that go. You know what I mean? Right. So I ain't trying you to blow him up too much, you know what I mean? But I do respect the hustle, you know what I mean? Sure. So, yeah. so it's a six year bourbon. That's funny. Uh, non chill filtered in American oak. That's okay. the only thing it's really saying about it. Gotcha. All right, let's, uh, let's get to it. See what it's talking about. Let's see what that court talk about. Clad? Pause for the court. <laughs> All right, Clyde. Okay, Clyde. All right, Clyde. Oh, Clyde. <laughs> right. Hey, Clyde to Clyde. <laughs> Clyde to Clyde. <laughs> Who does not get enough respect, no, by the way, dog? Clyde to Clyde is the truth, boy. Yes, dog. Niggas act like you trash or something. It's crazy to me. Oh, Shout out to Clyde, man. Hey, Clyde. <laughs> <laughs> So off rip, I'm trying to hurry up and see what these what's to these apples. These apples are straight up in there. They straight up mm -hmm. in there? Come got the cork over there. Just as soon as that's the first yeah, thing you smell. <laughs> apples. Yeah. Definitely apples. Yeah. Ooh, we. Alabama style, right? It it for sure smell like apple crown up. Uh, I'm for sure it so don't taste it, like it. It don't have the candy smell like apple crown do though. Sort of though. I don't think so. Sort of. I don't think so. I'm interested now. I was putting them but apples. <laughs> yeah. On the taste, I'm getting a lot of pepper and vanilla. Got some, yeah, definitely got the pepper. Pepper like a motherfucker. Some, some yeah. paint vanilla, yeah. No, it tastes like somebody put way too much pepper on the chicken. There. No finish, though. <laughs> no no hug. No, it disappears. Yeah, mm -hmm. it disappears. Which is dope. I like that, though. I like. I know that motherfuckers be wanting a hug, but I think it's dope when that bitch can hit for a minute and then disappear. Kind of evaporate. Got a little lingering vanilla taste. But definitely the, the, the pepper, the pepper straight off, off the mm -hmm. palate, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost, sure. It almost tastes like a rye. Mm -hmm. That more was than a, say. more yeah. than a, a whiskey. Almost. Almost. Nice sweetness to it, though. It got just enough sweetness. It's not Yo. too overpowering. I, I, like I thought the shit. apple taste would be a little... I mean, you know, you get the apple off the nose off the For rip. sure. I thought that was going to be a little overpowering on the palate, but it's, 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 not. It's, it's not really. Damn. Okay. All right, Clyde. <laughs> so I put two drops of water in. Opened up the apple, really opened up the pepper. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But brought in a little bit of caramel and some more of that vanilla. Mm. It's hella peppery. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, just, yeah, too much pepper on the chicken there. <laughs> All right, so uh, let me fix my camera. Then, Even right? with the water, now it's going to the side of my tongue mm -hmm. instead of just being on the top. It's, right. It's, you know, it's, it's having an effect on it. So sure. I want to put this out there, too, though. Mm -hmm. All right. It's a little pricey. Mm. Price point on this, seventy. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. I don't think that. I mean, not horrible. Much. Not horrible. But, like, yeah. thing, but it's up. It's yeah, up. It's others. It's up. Yeah. It's up. Okay. Mm. I think I can fuck with it though. 
All right, so you got it. It did something. The cigar brings out that apple. Really? I thought it'd be the other way yeah, around. It brings out the apple. I mean, even more. Yeah. It went from that that uh that red delicious apple over to the <laughs> Granny Smith kind of. It's still apple. It's still apple. Me. It's still yeah, apple, it's, but, it's yeah. apple. But I mean, you can. I'm actually tasting the difference in the apple before and after the cigar. The cigar. So I yeah. can actually taste the difference. Hmm. Maybe I'm just Interesting. Being I don't know. Yeah, probably that too, though. <laughs> probably. All right, we'll go to commercial break real quick. And when we get back, you already know what time it is, man. One to five Black Power Fist rating. We're going to see what each of us give it, and uh, we'll be back. So, till we get back, you know what it is. Everybody loves BBW. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Be back in just a moment. Visit the website right now, www.everybodylovesbbw. That's beards, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. And we're back. Thank you guys for hanging out through the commercial break. You already know what it is. Everybody loves BBW, man. That's beards, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. I'm trying to keep a straight face now. Black jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn black jobs, man. All right, we back, man. Time to give it to one of the five black power fist rating. Again, if you just now chiming in, we're talking about the Clyde Mays Special Reserve Straight Bourbon Whiskey, 110 proof. Uh, uh, last week, we started with Angry Principal. So, Bo, we're going to start with you this time. One to five, dog. What you, uh, you want to give? It? All right. Um, apples off the nose, off rip, right? Um, mm-hmm. The palate. I got some vanillas, definitely some pepper. <laughs> pepper, sure. you know, pepper definitely for it. Um, not, not really much of a hug or, or, or a finish. You know, like Angry Principal said, it kind of disappears. Um, with the cigar, though, I did, it did bring out a little bit more of that, that, that apple taste, like more of like a red apple for me. But um, I give it a two and a half. I give it a two okay. and a half. For sure. All right, Angry Principal, what'd you say? Um... One, I would definitely. Oh, are you replacing this bottle? Yeah, I'll, I'd replace it. I replace. Okay. Oh, uh, the price point is, is uh, 70. 70 okay. so. so at seventy, because it's such a distinct taste, it's better than I had a different expression of theirs. Mm-hmm. I never replaced it, mm-hmm. and that's been two, three years. Okay. So this I would replace, even at seventy bucks. The apple taste, a little bit of complexity when you add the water, bring some more out of it. Even with the pepper. I would definitely replace this one, and it get it does disappear. No hug, no lingering mm-hmm. taste, nothing. It does but disappear. It, it initially that initial taste. I'm gonna give it a. Th- I'm gonna give it a three. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a three. I, I actually do like this one. Okay. Yeah. And it's different because it is different. It, it yeah. has a distinct taste to it because it's so fruit forward. Right. That, yeah. It's my first it. time having. Yeah. You know, it's, uh, it's definitely any different. expression of Clyde Mays too. So yeah. if if you see Clyde Mays. I wouldn't mess with the other ones. I'd mess with this one. Mm, special okay. Reserve. Yeah, special Reserve. Don't, don't, don't screw with the other ones, the the, the yellow label and a couple others. Yeah. Okay. Go with the red label. That's that's the way to go. Gotcha. You can't miss it. <laughs> right. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very busy. It's very busy. busy. There's a lot going on. <laughs> My ADHD is not doing no. well with this bottle. <laughs> no, no. And so, on that note, man, I'm going to round it off. Um, I'm going to give it I'm gonna give it a 2.5. Um, I do actually like, I like the taste, even though, uh, again, I mention this a lot. I do like a sweeter, uh, a sweeter taste, but normally like if it's vanilla or caramel, like the fruitier kind of sweetness, I don't particularly care for. Um, but I will say that it's, it's surprisingly less appley than it smells. So like the smell would probably turn you off once it hits your nose. It, it tastes like you're about to eat apple pie or something, but uh, there's a hint of apple in there, and I think it's just enough vanilla and everything going on after after the fact uh, to kind of cure that. And, of course, the pepper gives me a, a little bit of a tease of rye that I don't always like, but there's some rye that I love. But uh, that's a whole other conversation. So I'm going to give it a 2.5, though. And for even at the price point, though, like I think it's good and it's distinct enough that I would replace it. Uh, you know, if I ran through it, I would replace that one. Ran through it. If I know, ran right? through it. If yeah. <laughs> and the fact that I just said ran through yeah, it, I know. Though, it's, just, <laughs> it's just amazing. Like, I'll tell you where my mind is at right, right now. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> too, I thought about it after I said it, like, damn, ran, ran through, through it. So on that note, uh, we're going to go ahead and get out of here. <laughs> Put away wet. <laughs> 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 Yeah, 
You already know what it is. Oh boy. Everybody apparently <laughs> loves BBW. <laughs> Wet. Wet. <laughs> Moist. <laughs> Yo, uh beers, bourbon, whiskey's a podcast, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Come on, man. Angry principal in the building. Hey, Char, go talk to us soon. Hey. <laughs> Drink what you like, how you like. Oh, shit. My man, Bo, hold it down. About to run through these bourbons. <laughs> I'll say, y'all. <laughs> and of course, man, it's your boy. Q Lewis holding it down live from the 4205, man. Peace out, y'all. <laughs> God damn. That shit got... Run through these bourbons. I don't know why I said that shit. <laughs>